Hello YouTube, it's me here again with another lovely engine. This one is a Sato FA-170R3. Been converted to fully gas conversion uh, with the magnet ring, sensor bracket, uh, uh, triple ignitions and a lovely Kilio exhaust system Warble carb and I have this engine for quite a while now and I've been doing some testing with it and no matter what um, carburetor settings on the low end that I put in I could never get this cylinder to keep running as the other two it's always dropped in and out, in and out, flood with fuel quite a lot. And what I did, I took the intake off and I noticed the, the fuel was feed uh, direct from the carburetor into the cylinder and it had a W going to this cylinder and that one. So this one always was flooded with fuel and it could never keep at idle. Um, anything below 2000 anything above that it will trip in but it always spits a lot of fuel out before it catches itself um, so what I did I I remake the intake and I put the fuel directly into all the cylinders um, this one that one and the other one so all the cylinders is feeding direct from the center of the carburetor um, you could see there and as well, the carburetor have a reducer to reduce the uh, Venturi from 30 millimeter down to seven millimeter um, because this is a bigger, um, this is too much of a bigger Venturi for this size engine. Um, I've done several testing with it, it works fine. And with this new intake modification, I see a lot in difference of the idling always idle in this uh, cylinder as well happily as the others and top rpm as well it doesn't hesitate to get to the top rpm mid-range really smooth as well and so that's pretty much it then this just this new um, intake modification i replaced the old one and i'm gonna shoot a video and see what you think okay gonna give it a start now Battery plugged in. You can hear it idling on all of the cylinders. You can't hear any of the cylinders doing any bubble sound like what it used to do before, um, which is really good. Depends on your navigation, you're going to keep your eye lane a bit higher as well. This one is eye lane quite lowly as you can see. 1100, uh, between 11 and 12. Normally on our vacation you keep your eye low about 1500 for your landing um, preferences. But this is what it set out for now. But I'll see how it goes.
So as you can see, it's a total um, different engine. Um, idles happily there, are they between 12 and 1100. Um, transition is really good on it. Um, uh, the top RPM I'm seeing with it, uh, the engine is brand new as well. But this prop is a 18 by 6 um, carbon prop. Top RPM I'm seeing it's between uh, 66 and 67 on the top end. Um, the engine is brand new, I'm taking it easy on it. I'm not supposed to be revving it like that, but just to show the response on the throttle itself. Um, it doesn't bug down or anything with any of the cylinders now as what it used to do before especially with this cylinder keep getting in flood um, with too much fuel and quite a lot of people being asking me what's the needle settings as well for the go version plus the gas can version version and it was really hard to say but I just did an experiment with the intake and I think um, I achieve a little bit of um, on the low end um, responsive and on the top end as well so if you're interested in the intake let me know I could get one for you it's no problem put on your engine I believe this one will fit the 170 and the 200 I'm not a hundred percent sure about the 200 but I think they're the same crankcase size but I will know in the future and as well, there will be a link in this description where you'll find the kit, the conversion kit, the ring, bracket and carb kit, and as well as the intake. So a couple links will be in the description of the video where we'll take you to my website where you could find these parts. Um, so that's pretty much it. I'm running a 20 to 1 mix, um, red line. To stroke racing oil that's my all that i use the highest octane fuel that i could get i think it's 97 octane um that's my setup and um if you have any question let me know um in in the drop down menu in the bottom of the video and stay tuned for more great videos to come all right cheers bye